Hey everybody, Mark Walters here, and in this video I wanted to share with you some things that you might want to consider when you're negotiating with a lender for a property. Now, as I make this video, lenders have lots of properties that they've taken back. They foreclosed on the house, for whatever reason the house did not sell at auction, and now the lender has the property. Now, there are all different kinds of strategies, but I just wanted to share with you to not overlook the fact that lenders may be willing to negotiate. And what are some of the things that they'd be able to uh, negotiate here? Well, of course, price. That's one thing that most people think about. But let's say you want to get a loan through them. Let's say that uh, maybe this is a property that that falls into uh, the potential. So they may be willing to negotiate and be willing to take lower than normal down payment, lower than normal interest rate. So, you know, the terms is something else that they might be willing to negotiate. So always be interested in asking this. Now, obviously, lenders are going to be happiest if you can... Uh, oh, we've got a thirsty dog. We've got two thirsty dogs. <laughs> oh, that's an old dog teaching a new dog new tricks. Anyway, uh, be sure and... Where was I? Be sure and, uh, and at least ask for these, uh, for these uh, points, you know, price, down payment, interest rate. Now some lenders, of course, they're just gonna want price, how fast can you close, bada bing, bada boom. But not all lenders are gonna feel that way and not all situations are gonna be that way. And if you can negotiate for something like that, maybe it's a property that you wanna hang on to. Maybe it's in an area that you feel strongly about, you think that it's gonna go up in value over the years. Maybe you've negotiated a price that uh, is gonna cash flow, so when you rent it out, you're gonna make either break even or positive cash flow. Or maybe it's something that you're willing to assign over to someone else after you've gotten the deal or sell it to them, offer them you know, some of the, the similar terms. Or maybe it's just that it's such a good deal, you're able to, again, offer it to somebody, even an investor, at a great price because you've gotten a great price. But always ask. It doesn't hurt to ask and you'd be surprised uh, at what you discover if you do ask. And then that gives you the confidence to ask in future deals. And then when you uh, add up all the savings in a number of deals that you do, it really can make uh, a big mountain of savings. So try it and uh, just continue to negotiate and see what good things will happen from it. I'm Mark Walters and I look forward to sharing more with you very soon.